Daybreak as well. State police have just released the names of the mother and her twin daughters killed in a fiery crash on 465 Sunday afternoon. They've also given new information about why they've arrested the driver of a semi accused of causing all of it. News 8's Katie Wisely joins us live with those new details. Katie? Hey, good morning. That semi driver is 57 year old Bruce Pollard from Missouri. He's currently right here behind me in the Marion County Jail being held without bond. Indiana State Police arrested him just hours after that crash yesterday. Now take a look at your screen. This is seen video that we got yesterday on I-465 at Keystone Avenue. Officials say a semi was driving well above the speed limit on 465 eastbound when Pollard hit a car that burst into flames. Now inside that car, 29 Nine year old Alana Coons and her two twin 18 month old daughters, June and Ruby Coons, died at the scene. ISP says Pollard faces three counts of reckless homicide and five counts of criminal recklessness causing injury. The semi also hit four other cars and overturned a Chevy truck. The crash happened in a construction zone, and police want to make sure drivers are paying close attention while driving near construction. It's very important that when you see those orange signs, you see the barrels, the flashing lights, the whatever you see, you increase your attention as well as increase your following distance, decrease your speed, and simply just drive safely. Seven adults were transported to the hospital. Two of those are in critical condition. The Indianapolis Fire Department says crews from Carmel and Pike Township responded to the scene to help clean up a debris field three quarters of a mile long. Now, Pollard was treated at the scene for a minor abrasion. He was then brought here to the Marion County Jail. He is due in court this week. Back to you. Wisely, thank you. Another weekend crash in a